Hi everybody, welcome to the weekend update, December 8th. Hopefully everybody's off to a good December start. Getting all that holiday shopping done and getting all the, the parties lined up. Uh, wanted to wish everybody out there a happy Hanukkah, which started, I believe, yesterday. Um, so um, to all of our, our Jewish friends out there, hopefully you have a great time celebrating Hanukkah and a good, good season with family. Uh, jumping into our weekend update here, our first thing here, we got our market updates and lots of uh, lots of good news. Now, the uh, the compared to a week ago can be a little bit off because last week was the Thanksgiving week stats. Uh, so we had 50% more show means than Thanksgiving week last week. So that's not uh, not totally surprising, but I like to compare it to a year ago as well. So this is the whole DC metropolitan area, 11% less showings, uh, which isn't too bad. Uh, pretty comparable to last year. Um, you know, 5% less contracts, which is about 50 contracts uh, week over week from last year. Uh, meeting days on contract, about the same. 3% less new listings. So about the same, about 25 less new listings uh, last year than this year, or this year than last year. So roughly the same stats as this week last year to, to touch off in all three, you know, main categories I like to look at. Our Central Virginia stats, we've got 5% um, off in showings. Year to year, uh, which isn't a ton, 7% new contracts, which is really 21 contracts, so not a huge deal on that number there. And new listings almost exactly the same, uh, up a, you know, one, two new listings from last year at the same time period. Our Baltimore metro area, uh, good stats up here, 6% off in showing, so consistent across the board. 1.7%, uh, almost the exact same amount of contracts in the Baltimore metro area, and 14% more listings this year than last year, so that's great. That's you know, about 70 more listings uh, than last year. So good stuff. Our last one here, Maryland, West Virginia Panhandle, almost the exact same amount of showings as a year ago. Five and a half percent more contracts. That's about 10 more contracts, nine more contracts. And then 26.8% more listings, which is great. It's 27%. That's, you know, about 30 more listings than last year at this time, because there's only 123 total, but it's a good chunk more, which is good stuff. Um, so relatively good stats compared to last year across the board. Our top performers for last week, uh, those crushing it as we get December going. Bed Cat Gurum, great week. Josh Velez, Will Kilker, great job, Will. Uh, Kieran Marzaria, awesome job. And then Dallas Croft out of Winchester, fantastic job. Our top five individuals in volume for last week. Our top five performers in transactions for the week. Uh, ben Cat Gurum, the double number one. Uh, Tonga Turner, fantastic job. Also one of our guests at our sales meeting a couple months ago. Uh, Dallas Croft, Rex Thomas, so I got to see you at the uh, Gaithersburg party. Good seeing you out there, Rex. And Suyin Ri, so great job to you top five transactions for the week. Our top five teams for the week. In volume, Miss Carolyn Young, the Carolyn Young team. Uh, Carolyn will actually be one of our guests at the sales meeting next Wednesday here in Chantilly, our super sales meeting. Uh, Shepherd Homes Group, led by Jason Shepard, coming in strong. The One Street Company, uh, fantastic job as always. The Casey Sampson team and living the easy life real estate with Tammy Irby. Our top five in transactions for the week. A similar list, one new team in there, the Carolyn Young team with the double number one for the week, great job. Shepherd Homes Group, the double number two. One Street Company, double number three. And then the Monumental team with Roxanne and Austin Southern popping in there. And then the Casey Sampson team riding out the top five. So great job to our top teams and individuals for last week. Announcements and, team and news save the dates. Remember, we're continuing our great work with Samson Cares. All the boxes are still in all of our offices. We'd love to have you come in, drop that gently. Use sporting equipment, canned food collection, toys collection, animal shelter stuff, and military needs collection. All those will be open until December 15th. So we got another week with all those boxes in our offices. Next Saturday, the 16th, uh, National Reese Across America Day. Uh, you can volunteer there, go down to DC or Arlington National Seminary, drop Reese on all the, the fallen soldiers. Uh, some, uh, grave site so it's a great great time to give back to the community and those that gave it all uh, for us um, and then we've got uh, next Wednesday we've got our Chantilly super sales meeting here in our office in our studio gonna be a great time 10 to 11 45 I know Carolyn Young will be one of the guests uh, still confirming our second guest right now hopefully she have that locked down today uh, we'll have some great tidbits great news that's always going on great conversation I would love you can always watch it online but come into the studio it's a lot better experience uh, we get to interact with each other. We have some great breakfast. We'll have some food later because afterwards, we also have our gold sponsor showcase here in our office here at headquarters where a lot of our, you can see a lot of the sponsors there below that are going to be here. They're going to set up booths. You can walk around, meet all those people, get to know them. 
you want to have those great contractors, those great relationships, um, you know, so that if you need them in, in time of need, you can stop by and do those things. Our holiday parties. We've been rocking and rolling so far. You can see that uh, that's a great one, Heather. Thanks for finding me one of uh, Sarah and I when we found the cupcakes. That was in National Harbor. Those were excellent cupcakes, by the way. Mine was carrot cake. Um, but uh, we had a great party at Stafford uh, last week. Uh, and then this week, we already hit up National Harbor on Monday. Uh, Gaithersburg on Wednesday was fantastic. I'm sorry to s skip out on the karaoke, but it looks like uh, my brother Bobby was able to, to hold it down. I had to get to girls basketball practice. Uh, Bowie, uh, fantastic. We're out there tonight. Uh, can't wait to have that. And then next week, we have Alexandria on Monday. Gaithersburg, or Gainesville on Tuesday, sorry. Uh, Richmond on Thursday night, excited for that. And then Lake Ridge on Friday night. So it'll be a fun week. And then we finish off our party circuit in Charlestown, where I get to spend my 19th anniversary with my lovely wife, Meredith, in Charlestown at our holiday party. So it's going to be a fun night out there. So I had a lot of great fun so far. Can't wait for a lot more fun to come. There's a lot of some of the great pictures from the road. Uh, we'll do a better job of getting these up on all of our socials. And if you've got pictures, post them out there. Tag Samson Properties. We want to know. Tag me on Facebook. I'd love to have them. I'd love to share them out all over the place. Show all the good fun that we're having. So please continue to tag me in those pictures. Tag Samson Properties. We'll continue to share those out there. Um, HQ to you. We were out there Wednesday at Frederick. It was fantastic. Great turnout. Great teaching. Great classes. Great one another. So uh, was awesome. You know, I walked in the room and you know I never know what to, to expect. But I turn in and there's 40 people there. It's packed, 50 people all the way to the back, and great conversations. I think we could have had that commission co uh, lawsuit conversation for another hour probably. But good stuff there. We're going to be in Richmond on Thursday. So Richmond on Thursday. Excited to see everybody. Look, if you're in Fredericksburg or somewhere south, take a trip down 95. Come see us for the day down in Richmond. Added bonus that not only do we have the HQ to you all day, 9 to 3, we actually have our holiday party at 4, so you can stick around, have some food and drinks, and hang out with us uh, afterwards. So it's going to be a great day down in Richmond on Thursday. Uh, our HQ to you's we've already announced for January. So we've got Bowie on the 3rd, Arlington on the 10th. I think we're going to flip these last two, unfortunately. I think we're going to flip, we're going to do Chantilly in studio here on the 24th, probably, and Waldorf on the 31st. We will confirm that, but I wanted to give you guys a heads up. It has to do with where we can book our lunch and learns. So I think we're going to do Chantilly on the 24th and Waldorf on the 31st and flip those. But uh, we will update you, though, in the, in the coming weeks there. But plan that those two locations are definitely going to happen. And Bowie and Arlington are locked in for sure. Remember, you can always jump into our fourth quarter challenge. We've got um, 217 total people competing with Lynn. And Lynn is uh, just giving you tasks to do, things to follow up on. It's just fantastic stuff. You want to get your business right for 2024. That work starts at the end of 2023. Yes, have fun. Enjoy your uh, friends and family in this holiday season, but lock your business down, set those goals, set those patterns that are going to make you successful for next year. Remember, you can always recruit, get recruiting rewards, inviting your friends to lunch and learns. We're going to be in Richmond at Terrence West, a great restaurant there in downtown Richmond on Thursday, 1230 to 230. Can't wait to see all of our friends down there. Um, yes, that is a nice Santa hat that Heather put on my head there. So thank you for that. And then in January, we've got a bunch of lunch and learns. We've locked down most of these already. We've got Bowie, uh, Renditions Golf Course. We had a great time there. We're going to go back there on Wednesday, the 3rd, right after the New Year. Uh, January 10th, we're going to be at Tyson's Corner Ruth Steakhouse. Uh, Ruth Chris Steakhouse, always a great time there. Always get a packed house. Thursday, January 18th, we're going to be at Eddie Merlot's in One Loudon. Uh, great, great, uh, great restaurant. Actually, it was on the on the list that I might book for my my real anniversary dinner. Uh, not to offend everybody at Charlestown, that's not where I'm actually going to take my wife for our real anniversary celebration. But maybe Eddie Merlot's, we'll see. Uh, and then Waldorf to be determined. It's either being 24th or 31st. We're working on that. And then Winchester, we're going to be at the GW Hotel January 30th, uh, which would be a good time there. And that's right next to our office in downtown Winchester. We we'll down there. We haven't been down there in a few months. So down to Winchester for lunch and learn. Upcoming classes, we talked about our HQ to use. Um, Jumpstart tomorrow. If you're watching this today, watch it quick and get out there. It's been on the calendar for a while, but Jumpstart, hashtag no excuses. If you're a dual career agent, Lynn's going to teach a whole boot camp tomorrow on Saturday. Do all of Jumpstart in one day. You don't have to be a dual career. You could have just maybe not gotten to it before. But if you have a free day, you are not, you will definitely walk away from it going, that was worth my time. Lynn teaches a great series with Jumpstart. You'll be overwhelmed with all the stuff, but it will give you a jumpstart in your business, whether you're brand new or you're just kind of in a rut. 
this year wasn't what you wanted to be, come in, take Jumpstart. It'll give you paddles. Jumpstart your career for sure. Soar is the great series that Cardinal has been putting on our Realtor uh, Development Series. We're going to be in Alexandria on Monday, this Monday, the 11th. Assumptions and Creative Financing with uh, Mary Fredenberg. And then 11 o'clock, How to Adjust Your Buyer and Seller Consultations uh, with Lynn Hamilton, who does a great job teaching that class as well to how to prepare and how to best talk to clients with some of this commission lawsuit coming on uh, in the news. So that'll be Monday morning in Alexandria as well. As an added bonus there, if you go to the SOAR, we're having our, our holiday party at 12 right after that in Alexandria. So you can double up there, have some fun with us there. See what we do? So strategic sometimes, or lucky, one of the two. Uh, we've also got KV Core and Lofty on the road. Uh, Lori's teaching that Tuesday, December 12th. She'll be up in Bowie all day teaching both of those. Uh, what are the differences and letting you hands on, bring your laptop, dive in and learn how to use both of those things. Mm. A quick shot of life juice there. Uh, five days of Festivus, uh, December 13th to the 19th. Lori's gonna teach classes every day, 245 virtual classes where you can dive into KV Core and Lofty and, and start to use those uh, more proficiently. Our agent services team always doing a great job with agent orientations. You can see there, we got two, three, four every week. It looks like we've got five scheduled for next week all over the place. Reston, McLean, White Marsh, Frederick, Chantilly. Um, so great stuff all over the place. And, and these are great classes that uh, Bethany and the whole agent services team uh, puts on. All right, digging into every single thing we got on schedule for next week. Monday, 10 a.m., talked about it sore. 10 a.m., 11 a.m. classes in Alexandria. You can stick around and have fun with us in Alexandria. It's a white elephant. We'll have a good time. Um, Samson Daily Huddles. We're going to have those Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 10 o'clock. So you see the 11th, 13th, and 15th. Tracking the market using Bright. This is a virtual class with one of the Bright teachers. 12 o'clock Monday. You know, there's so much market data out there that we can learn. Most of you guys don't know how to use Bright to its fullest extent. Most of you guys, me as well. Um, Get in there, you learn how you can use Bright to simply um, track the market better. You know, Casey does a good job of that. Casey sees all his stats flying over the place. It's because Casey's gotten really good at using Bright and trying to figure out, manipulating statistics to figure out what's going on in the market in all the areas that he thinks are, are important to him. You know, he's gonna run those charts and he knows them like the back of his hand. You can learn how to use Bright in a more proficient way in that class. Every Monday, KV Core and Lofty set up back to back 12, 30, one o'clock. If you're brand new to using either one, that's the class to jump into. Our free coaching class for the week, Tuesday at 10 a.m. with Lisa Fry, a money-making mindset of a top producer. I love that. It's going to be great, Lisa. We have a wholesale seminar, uh, Tuesday at 11 o'clock in our Chantilly office here with Four Brothers. It's a great group that does a lot of wholesaling. They will teach you how to do it. They're going to give you some great tips um, on, you know, if you've ever been curious on how to do that or what that's all about, it can be another good money-making activity. Um, another business stream that if you want to get into, you can either learn about it so you can see if you want to dip your head into it, or you can say you can learn enough to be dangerous, refer some stuff over to Four Brothers, but a great class there that I met those, those that group and they're, they're very knowledgeable, do a good job in this space. KV Core Lofty on the road, Tuesday will be in Bowie with Lori. Sky Slope Training always Tuesday afternoon with Stephanie. Our super sales meeting here Wednesday. Wednesday is going to be a great day in our Chantilly office. We have our sales meeting in the morning, our gold sponsor showcase in the afternoon. Uh, starting that afternoon, you got the five days of Festivus with Lori, the 245 trainings on KB Core every day, and uh, Chime slash Lofty. Uh, Thursday, HQDU all day at our Richmond Libby Mill office. At one point, we talked about this being at the downtown Richmond office. It's going to be in our Libby Mill office. Beautiful space. Um, it's going to be great training all day. We encourage you guys to be down there. I can't wait to do it. Nine to three, hop into all those classes. It's going to be great. Uh, Thursday, at the same time, we also have the 10 o'clock. It's the mastermind group, five to $10 million. If that's your production level, hop into that Zoom, uh, get that game planning and accountability from everybody else that's in your same volume space. We can learn from each other. Uh, KV Core and Festivus uh, continues every day, 245. The free coach, another free group coaching class with Tracy Romero, we're doubling up next week. Deep dive into concierge services. That's six o'clock Thursday night with Tracy Romero. So thank you, Tracy, for that. Friday morning, wake up early, get ready, rock and roll, and get your day off to a great start. Commercial real estate webinar with Aladdin every Friday at 8.30. Then our contract training at 10 o'clock. GCAR and Montgomery County this week. So be Kara or Kim, Kara Williams or Kimberly Chen will be there. Kara Northcutt, uh, Northcutt or, or Kimberly Chen will be in there teaching that class. GCAR, Montgomery County Forms. Uh, Samson Daily Huddle as always. Friday Financing with First Heritage on Friday at 10 o'clock. 
Sky Soap Q&A as, no, as always. KB Corn Chime continuing every day at 245. And then our mastermind for dual career agents, 9 o'clock on Saturday. There's so many things, so many different groups, so many different opportunities to lock into the right section for you, um, the right class for you, the right group for you to continue to push forward. You can't do it all. But how do you eat that elephant one bite at a time? Find that one tool that you're going to add. Find that connection, that group that you can learn and, and be accountable to. It's going to help your business big time. So I'm excited. Interest rates have creeped down a good bit in the last couple of weeks. We're at our four-month lows right now. We're, we're thinking about getting into the sixes. I was in a mastermind lunch yesterday. A lot of people were quoting some clients that got rates in the sixes, which is good stuff. You know, I think as these interest rates continue to creep down and continue to stay at a, a better point than they were the last couple of months, we're going to keep some of those buyers out there and maybe spur some new buyers out there that are like, maybe I want to buy right now because if these rates keep slipping down, that competition in March, April, May is going to be crazy. You know, so maybe the interest rates get down to six and a half or six, but if they do, I'm going to have a lot more competition. I'm going to have a lot higher prices. I'm going to have a lot more bidding. I'm not going to get the home inspections. So if you've got people that are considering buying, right now is a good time. There's not a ton of inventory for them to choose from in the sense that, you know, that they don't have to compete with tons of people, but there's enough choices out there where they can get the home they want. They can probably get it as one of only a couple offers on it or one offer on it, maybe get a home inspection. But as these rates trickle down, we're gonna, we could see a, a super competitive market in the summer, spring and summer, which you know is great for transactions, great for being a listing agent, but for a buyer's agent, it can be frustrating. So uh, get off that fence, stay connected to your sphere of influence. We're gonna continue to pour out some, some great trainings and great teachings through the month of December for you. And I would encourage you, look, I know we didn't do 27 holiday parties this year like we did before, but um, please get out to one of these holiday parties. We'd love to hang out with each other. I think everybody that comes to these events really just has a great time, feels more connected to each other in that office or in that in that community. Um, you know, but we just have a good time. Sometimes it's great to get back out and enjoy one another and, and uh, excited to, to do that in, in all the fun fashions we have. I guess we have four next week, one tonight, f uh, four next week, and then and then finishing up the week after that. So hope everybody has a great weekend, um, enjoys family, enjoys all the activities, hopefully sell some homes. Brings them all to Cardinal Title Group. Uh, so thank you all for your continued support of Samson Properties uh, and Cardinal Title Group. And we will uh, see you at a holiday party or at our super sales meeting here in Chantilly on Wednesday. Have a great day.